The BYU Cougars never got a chance to see how far they could go in the NCAA tournament, and we've now seen the last of BYU's Yoli Childs. He will go down as one of the best players in school history. I was a, he was a guest on Cougar Sports Saturday on KSL News Radio and shared his thoughts on his career at BYU. Appreciate you hopping on board, man. Just kind of take us through the NCAA tournaments canceled. How, how's this been? How's this week? How you been holding up? Uh, it is. It, it's been unbelievably painful for for all the guys. Um, you know, obviously uh, last Monday didn't go how we wanted it to, but we were in a position where we felt that it was preparing us for bigger things, and um, we were all really excited for an opportunity that we've been fighting all season for, and a lot of us have been fighting our whole lives for. Um, so. It's definitely a very disappointing and hard time. Uh, a lot of the guys, we actually just got done playing pickup because that's one of the, the only things that feels normal right now is uh, playing the game, but together, some of us want it to end, but uh, we're going to grow from this. You know, th throughout this this uh, this pandemic, the world's going to grow from this. You know, our country's going to grow from this. Uh, BYU sports, we're going to grow from this. And as a team, we're going to grow from this. And uh, we've built bonds that are going to last a lifetime, and uh, we're just trying to have faith at this time that God's plan is greater than our plan. Yoli, take us through the the, the day that the NCAA tournament was canceled. What was it like in the morning? Did you guys have any any idea that it was heading that direction? And when did you guys get the news? Um, Coach was talking to us about possibly there being a pushback where the NCAA tournament would be delayed. And as he was saying that, he got news. The tournament was canceled. And it, it kind of just took the air out of the room. There was a, a long period of silence and a lot of tears, um, a lot of pain. Uh, this team has just sacrificed so much, so much more than people realize. Uh, every single guy on this team, um, we, were, we were really excited to make our dreams become reality. So, so it almost felt like a bad dream, but here we are. And, you know, We're in a position where we just have to keep pushing and, and keep going with our lives and, and keep getting better. I always think you'll be back to last May when, when you announced. Cougar Nation, I want to let you guys know I'm coming back for my senior year. Let's make some magic happen. Do you, do you feel like special was achieved in, in the 32 games you were able to play with this team? Um, I, th I think that we obviously hope for a different kind of special. We, we hope to uh, make noise in the tournament, and that's just reality. That's what we were hoping for, and that's what we wanted. And, um, but it's, it's been special to see uh, – community gather around this team it's been special to uh, see the way we fought for each other the way we sacrificed the way uh, each player has thrown out individual agendas to to make the team better it's, it's been special to see the sacrifice and the love in this locker room and, and with our fan bases and uh, it's definitely a, a group of guys that we'll all remember forever and uh, for that reason I feel it was a special event. It, it breaks my heart that I'm never going to be able to play on that court again for, the, for those fans but um, it's, it's been a heck of a journey. It's been a ton of fun, and uh, I'll be a cougar for the rest of my life.